Hi there, welcome back to Baldur's Gate. I'm Byron. In the last no, video, um, that guy Kagan joined our party. He's a lawful evil fighter and dwarf. And I don't want all evil characters in my party, but he gave us a quest. So let's see what that is all about. Um, he wants to find a, a boy that went, uh, you know, away with him, traveled with him. What would caravan you have that was ambushed. So we all saw right, some right. ambushed caravans to the north, so we, we will go there. That would be here, I guess. Go pester someone else. I'm tired of looking for the damn caravan. We'll never find it among all the other dead caravans we've been coming across. Let's just forget about it and keep to whatever you want to do. So, well, actually, there's no XP in it for us. That means you go. Bye bye. Oh wait. I need an L. You've got hardy hides, folk. If you ever need a little more rubber muscle round, you've got it. Really? You're with? All right, all right. I don't wanna talk. Okay. So hey, I think it's maybe a bad idea to have him like standing there. I will bring him back to where we got him. Where was it anyway? I think it was somewhere around here. All right, all right. Where was it here? What's that? The felt post. Uh, no, I think it was here. We got him here. We will return him to where we found him, just in case we need him later. Are you coming? No, oh, they're too stupid actually. Oh, no, actually not, there's a way. Oh, I wasn't aware of that. That's cool. So I think there was a door here. Get in there. Get all in right, there. All right. Yeah, this is where we found him. Point is, if I if I drop him somewhere in the wilderness, I may forget where he is, and if I need him again, I may not find him. Bye bye. Go pester someone else. Okay, you can stay what here. What would you have me do? Good. Got rid of him. So, but we wanted to explore that area I'm here. If you insist. What about that door here? Why is that closed? Because it's locked. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Your wish? All right, all right. What you want? Okay, maybe Imuan can do something about that. This way. Get in there, girl. Alan. You said something? Welcome, my dear. You are early. I excuse me. Indeed, I was expecting visitors, but none such as you. Be gone before my company arrives. I should not tolerate the mood being ruined by a band of miscreants. You are, you are a rude fellow, my friend. This is no way to talk to a lady. Uh, but you don't have anything here, okay? Why well, what's maybe some riches upstairs? Oh, there's a chest. I've done had enough of this. Yeah, what up? Nothing. Empty too. And here? Oh, who are you? Sleeping woman. Empty. How disappointing. And done. This way. Locked. You didn't see it. 
Someone has noticed. I serve the flaming fist. <sighs> Saka. That happens if someone sees you stealing. Fine. What would you have if you insist? <laughs> You're a queer fellow. I'm gone. I've done had enough of this. Okay. Will you leave now? You're not looking now. Ah, okay. I serve the flaming fist. Uh, you don't have to take it. It's enough to actually open the chest. And then the I'm you know, gone. Knight of the Flaming Fist appears. Well, then screw you. What would you have? All right, all right. Who are you? Oh, Garrick. Oh, Garrick. Hmm. Hello there. I have a pretty proposal for you. You do? Hey, adventurers, I have a proposal for you. I have heard that you are an excellent group of warriors. How would you like a well paying job as bodyguards for my mistress? Well, we're always on the lookout for money. Tell us more. I am Garrick and I work for Suke Rosena. She is the most skilled musician and actor along the Sword Coast. In fact, she she's to play at the Dutch Palace before the month's done. But she's been having some problems of late. Some thugs have been hired by Feldpost to hurt her bad because she didn't perform at his inn when she was supposed to. You can't blame her for not showing up uh, what with a villain like Feldpost running the place. She needs mercenaries to protect her until she's ready to go to Baldur's Gate. She's willing to pay about 300 gold, what do you say? That sounds, ki sounds kind of fair. Why don't you show us uh, to this mistress of yours? I think you've made a good decision. We uh, now just meet me outside of the Red Sheaf Inn. Okay... This will be interesting. Save. This is Silke. Yes, sir. This is my mistress, Miss Silke Rosena. Greetings, mercenaries. I'm Silke. Thespian <laughs> extraordinaire. Okay. Greetings, mercenaries. I am Silke. Thespian extraordinaire. Hello there. I see my Garrick has been rather busy. You look as if you're worth paying a little extra. What did my little helper offer you? I offered them 300 gold, just like you told me. I'll raise your wage to 400 gold. Well then, I assume that Garrick has explained what your duties are. You must simply be dispose of the ruffians when they come to threaten me. They shouldn't be too hard to deal with, but I would advise you to strike fast. Whatever you don't speak, whatever you do, don't speak with them. One of them is a mage whose mystic words can sway even the most wise of men. Ruffians. Greetings, mercenaries. I am Silky. That's Here. been extraordinary. Yeah, we know, we know. Shut up, bitch. Here they are now. Felt post thugs. Strike when I tell you. A guy named Falter says, Greetings, Silke. We are here as you've asked, and we have the... Don't try to threaten me. I won't be easy prey for you to beat on. We've brought friends. He didn't sound that threatening to me. What are you talking about? We're here with the gems, Dad? Shut up! There'll be no weaseling out of this one. Strike now! Kill them all! Um, well, they don't appear too threatening to me. It's, it looks like they were summoned. Stop this madness. We won't murder those who are obviously innocent men. Our deal is off. In any case, you are probably too cowardly to be any good in a fight. I'll deal with them myself after I deal with you. And with that, we start a fight. Your wish? 
So the point is uh, to Very keep well. her from casting spells. Can I nature help? servant? <laughs> You're oh, queer. Hurry up! Fire away. Oh, My blade will cut you down the side. Got to. Fuck. We are both dead. Uh, but you get the idea. Load. All Greetings, right, all right. mercenaries. I yeah, yeah, am yeah, Silky. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's been extraordinary. Greetings, mercenaries. I am Silky. That's been extraordinary. Let's try something else. What would else. you have me do? Everyone attack. And maybe you, you should use magic. Magic missile. Just one. Did I hit her? Yep. Very well. Good thing we killed her before we, she could cast her lightning spell. Uh, we got 900 XP and some items. 400 gold, yay. What now? Yes, sir. Silk is dead. I guess she had it coming. You can't be evil like her and expect to get away with it. I'm out of a job now. Would it be too much to ask if I could join up with you? No problem. Let's take a look at you. What about you here? Glade, Falters, and Tess. What? Tesselan. I've got the best prices this side of Cormier. We thank you for stopping the evil witch before she killed us. Here, take this as a token of our appreciation. And they go. What did we get? So we have a potion of invulnerability. Useful. Cannot use item. What the fuck? Can only be used by warriors. Quarter stuff plus one. Awesome. Uh, it's a 1d6. And that is a 1d4. Okay. Potion of Defense. Sets armor class to 0. Rather nice. So I will just give the dagger to him just in case. Um. He needs a magical weapon to attack someone. Okay, that's rather nice. We got some XP out of that. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. And this is Garrick the Bard. A chaotic neutral human. Decent dexterity. Weak source constitution. Average intelligence and wisdom. Quite charismatic. Uh, the constitution sucks. Uh, that's probably because he, uh, that's why he only gets, uh, no, zero hit, uh, additional hit points per level. What kind of skills do you have? Law of ten. Small swords and missile weapons are his game. When asked about his past, Garrick explains that he was part of a celebrated acting troupe called the Dale Wind Troubadours. They traveled the length of the coast from Neverwinter to Arm, often played to dukes and other nobility. Indeed, few others, few others could afford the cost of a performance when the group was at its peak. Garrick does not speak fondly of this time, however, as the direction the group was taking left him dissatisfied with their conduct. He apparently discovered that their performances were being used as distractions for thievery, and declared he would have nothing. And declared he would have nothing to do with it. Rebuffed, rebuffed by his comrades, now he wishes simply to travel and play his music for those that will listen. He seems a bit young and naive, and a touch too ready to take the word of a stranger. Yeah, okay, but I'm not really sure whether we will have a bard for long in the party, because 
Bard is not really a class you need. You need fighters, you need mages, you need clerics, you need thieves, but you don't really need bards. But still. Oh, he could... Uh, he doesn't have any spells. That's bad, actually. Not even a magic missile or something. Or could he memorize spells? I'm not really sure. A bard of the first level, can he memorize spells? Well, what do you have? One entries. Okay. So he's proficient with missile weapons, was it that? Missile weapons and small swords. Does that count as a missile weapon? Yep. So we give him a few more bolts and that's good. Probably, can he use heavy armor like a druid could? No. Not for bonds. But he could probably use a studded leather like Imoen does. But yeah. Um, Move up a bit. Hurry up! Or maybe not. No. Let's leave it at that. Okay. Did we go in here? No. Oh wait. Did we get like better reputation? No. Just 900 XP. You're a queer What's that? fellow. Oh, the burning wizard. What would you have me do if you insist? That's another end. We will take the whole party in here. Great. Who are you? Commoner, commoner, bartender. So long. I wish well. I had my old tobacco pipe. What is a thief to do, eh? Invest in some boots of stealth. You said up shop in the badlands to the south of Baragost and then wham along comes a tribe of hobgoblins and they tear the boots from right off your feet damn blasted bullies is what they are and I'll pay 100 gold to whoever uh, can get them back to me I will oh look it's Dritz the Erden actually not he stole 15 gold coins and um yeah, a pesky thief named Zulong has been pickpocketing me every time I try to get a word in edgewise, but I'd rather not cause a scene. He did mention losing some boots to hobgoblins in the badlands south of the city though. I get a sense somehow that returning those boots to him may be the only way to make peace and have my goods returned. He can be found in the Burning Wizard Tavern at Berigost. You Good. want the whiskey? Been a few days since I seen as many strangers as you brought with you. Hope the city treats you kindly. Okay, what do you have? Nothing. Great. Um, anything else? No. Wait, there's something here. Your wish, it's on the other side of that door. Insist. Nothing actually. What you want? Okay, let's get up here. I've done had enough. Okay, Span Gilme, so maybe I should Hurry have to bring up. the main character up if here too. You insist. Very hmm? well. Eh, what? Leave me be to firewine with ye, and I hope ye gets the goat, goat, whatever. Firewine? What and where is that? Firewine bridge run. Firewine Bridge Ruins is what I mean. She be pretty far to the south and east, but a pair of strong legs, or s but a strong pair of legs, will get you there just fine. I would make sure that you are strong enough to bring you back too, though. The Firewine Ruins might be quite a death trap for the inexperienced adventurer. Mind you, remember that, and don't blame old Span if you lose a few of your fellows stumbling about within. What else can you tell me about it? What? Do I look like uh, I be fool enough to go tromping about in such a place? Not likely. You want more info? You go talk to them halflings in Gullican. They be curious about such things and will probably help you. I warn you again though, it ain't no place for a youngin. You go there and you're just looking for trouble. For tough trouble. Best you cut your teeth somewhere else before you throw your lives down that hole. 
And what about Varagast? Anything interesting here? Hereabouts? The temple to the east is an interesting view. Ah, uh, be an interesting view. Uh, if you like that sort of thing. I don't. Don't like much, actually. Don't think I like you either. Okay, get the fuck out of here. Yep, I've done had enough of this. So there actually was no... Oh, locked. Okay. Do you see me or you don't you? You shouldn't be able to see me. There's a wall between us. Yep, there was a wall between us. Locked. Empty. Why would you lock an empty chest? I'm not going to ask again. And the dagger. What would you have me do? GTFO. All right, all right. Hey. You insist. Good, good, good. So, all right, all right. More to explore. Red chief. Oh, this looks like another end. Let's see what we can get in here somewhere. God's name is the door. Yeah. It's it's freaking locked. Why is that? I am at your service. Do you have any Wait, what's that? Thieving. You can't do it. Why? Battle song, okay. With then. joy, sir. locked and it looks like I can't unlock it. Weird. Hey. I care not. Oh, you I've can. done okay. had enough of this. And he obviously can only pickpocket and not uh, pick locks. Only pickpockets. Okay. Be quiet. Come on. Come on. I've on. done had enough of this. I've done had enough of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it failed. Yeah, yeah. Need a few more levels. Locked. Mm. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Hurry up! So, but there's no way to actually go in here, really. But this looks like this is another house. How do I get in here? Oh, if you insist. <clears throat> Nature servant. Quiet. You're at the end of your rope. What would you I'll have wager. me do? Call out. Oh, fuck. You're at the end of your rope, I'll, ra I'll wager. Not that this is anything personal, you understand, but I'm afraid your time on this here ball of mud is just about done. This looks like another assassination attempt. Why are you doing this? I have not done nothing to you. You have done nothing to anyone, far as I know. Don't matter one whit to me. A prize is a prize, a head is a head, and whenever the two meet, there's old Carlot making his living. Like I said, it's nothing personal. Stop. Your wish? Everyone attacks. Hurry up! You get the fuck out of here. Alright, alright! 
Wait. Okay. Then you use your sword. Uh, can I help you? On him? I'll do my best. What would you have me you do? Switch to sling oh and attack. Oh, right. Better part of valor. Better part of valor. You suck, sir. Yes, O oh omnipresent authority figure. Okay. That Your means. Wish? What about him? Is he hurt anyway? <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Use magic missiles on him. You've attacked? And you cast another healing on your husband. <laughs> Fuck what? you. You die. I, I swear you. When was the last time that I saved? Here? I'm hmm? gone. What would you have me do? Hmm? All right, all right. Okay, so huh, we have to do all that queer. again, I've really? Done had enough of this. There's nothing in here. And the last one. Your wish? All right, all right. Quiet. Done. Okay. Very well. Wait. What yes, about you? Sir. Uh, can I? I can. Get out here. Too. Hurry up! All right, all right. You have needed me. So then equip your shield. No, you can't while you have the bow. Okay. What would you have me do? All right, all right. Come on. Save. Get in there again. You're at the end of your rope, I'll wager. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, your wish? Everybody attack. Hurry up! You move away. Well. Nature you servant awaits. An entangled spell. Oh. Worked. Everybody yes, scrap. or the group. <coughs> uh, if none are better. What you want? I've done had enough of this. Thank you. Uh, can I quiet? So now everybody what would you have attack him. Do? Oh, my heart's really not in this. Move on. For the fallen! Bingo. Dead. Very well. So, what did we get? Scroll. Another bounty notice. Be it known to all those of evil intent that a bounty has been placed upon the head of Haywitch Ablomi for the foster child of Gorion. Last seen in the area of Candlekeep, this person is to be killed in quick order. Uh, the offer has been extended to all appropriate guilds. Those returning with proof of the deed shall receive no less than 350 gold coins. I think that's more than the last time. As always, any that reveal these plans to the forces of law shall join the target in their fate. What do we have? Chainmail armor. It's probably not as good as a plate mail. Yep. 
But maybe for you? Yeah. Nice. I think that worked nicely. Yeah. I will take a second and tangle. This spell is useful. What do we have here? Yep. I'm gone. Locked. Lockpick failed. You Ooh. wish? Uh, let's save. If you insist. How, wait, how much XP did I get for killing him? 270. Mm. Okay. Commoner. 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 Purdue. Okay. Queer things have been a lately. Hello, you wouldn't uh, have happened to see a big loudish guy with a dog's head on him around here, have you? A dog's head? You heard me, a dog's head. And breath that could peel paint too. Ignore. Yes, ignore. There's one hold up in the hills uh, due west of here, close to the high hedge. Damn thieving ball of first stole my short sword two days ago. Hmm, never liked them myself. How much would the blade be worth to a runty guy like you? Yeah, yeah, lay off the short guy jokes. They are older than your grandmother's uncle. The damn blade ain't worth nothing. It's a pride thing. I'll give you 50 gold if you wipe its arse with it. Okay, you got yourself a deal. Anything else? Quiet. <laughs> oh. oh. Stupid. You what about you, bartender? What do you have? Nothing actually. Okay. Then no, hurry up! I just care not. And me. If you insist. Let's head upstairs. The rest can stay down here. So it doesn't get that much crowded up in here. Hey, fucker, move it. Thank you. Raleo Windspear. Glad insist. to meet you, friend. Hey, and well, my traveler. Raleo is the name. Raleo Windspear. I haven't seen you around here before. Perhaps you're new to town then? I make a point of meeting as many people as I can wherever I go. Okay, what can you tell me? If, hmm. What have you uh, have you been to the south? I heard of trouble in Nashkel. I haven't been down that way for some time now, so I don't have much to say. Likely you will have heard much from out of the bad town anyway. Can you tell me of Berigos then? Hmm. Any outstanding quests that need resolution? I fancy myself a bit of an adventurer. An adventurer, eh? Well, if you are up to the task, I hear there are strange things in the Alcaster school ruins southeast of town. I would never go down there unless you are quite sure your, uh, of your abilities, though. Many a well meaning fellow has gone and not come back, only for those adept in battle. Others than that, I know that the Lady Miran has been awaiting news of her husband for some time. He was to come up from arm, but is overdue. I know she would be grateful for any news. She lives on the east edge of town. If you find anything, anything else, would you like to know of? Uh, well, what are the concerns of the day? Hmm. Oh, I suspect you mean the iron shortage. I imagine it has affected the local smithy quite a bit. Terum is a wonderful blacksmith, but he's got a lot of time on his hands these days. His shop is still reasonably stuck, but I think he's looking for other materials to work on these days. Not sure what that might be, but he's quite adept at exotic materials. Anything else I can help you with? Um, nothing in particular, just interested in the sites, perhaps shopping. 
shopping then you must stop by Felpus Inn. They have a number of trophy items for sale. Some are even magical in nature. Did we check that? I uh, best you bring gold aptly though. They are not cheap. If you really have coins to spare, I suggest going west of the city and seeking out Talantir. He has a shop in his keep. Although he does not welcome visitors, trust me, you will want to speak with him immediately if you go there. Wandering about his shop without permission is downright deadly. I think he likes scaring folks a bit. Okay. We got some info. Nice. <laughs> You're a queer. I've done had enough of this. What about this one here? It's locked. Okay, but since he's looking... No... What the f... Get in here! Okay, take it. Yay, yay. Slowly but steady. We're getting rich. Oh, wait. Thank you, much better actually. I don't really know whether he can see me. Well, apparently not. Hey, what the... Okay, so we got some loot, that's nice. What would you have me do? All right, all right. And now we will leave. Hey, I said go down. Thank you. Your wish? Very well. Alright, alright! What time is it? Okay, 2 in the morning. Move it, Jahira. Uh, no, is that Jahira? Yes, it's Jahira. So, I think we should save now. So, thank you very much for watching and have a nice day. Bye!